Hi students, today I am going to explain you about aldol and cross aldol condensation. Generally, aldehydes and ketones having at least one alpha hydrogen undergo a reaction in the presence of uh, dilute alkali as catalyst to form beta hydroxy aldehydes or beta hydroxy ketones we call it as aldol condensation if both are same type of reactants like both are uh, uh, same type acetaldehyde acetaldehyde both are ketones like acetone acetone are reacting then we call it as the product and the uh, aldol and the reaction is aldol condensation if both are different like acetaldehyde and propanaldehyde both are different then we call it as a cross aldol condensation see here two moles of acetaldehyde is undergoing reaction in the presence of base like NaOH it results in the formation of this compound this is called 3 hydroxy butanol This is also known as aldol because of the presence of alcohol group and aldehyde group. Because of the presence of aldehyde group ald and because of the presence of alcohol group ol. This product we call it as aldol which undergoes a condensation. It results in the formation of this uh, alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl compound here OH and H undergoes condensation and water molecule is released it results in the formation of this product this is but 2 in all now I am not going to tell you about the mechanism I am going to explain you the amazing trick which works out a lot you can write any kind of product of aldol condensation just by seeing the reactants within a minute see this whenever two moles of acetaldehyde is undergoing reaction how to write the product see it first remove an O from this aldehyde and remove two hydrogens from this remove two hydrogens and this oxygen both goes as H2O then see here how to write the product first write CH3 and C next to this hydrogen is there write that hydrogen whenever you remove one oxygen and two hydrogens put a double bond here Next, after removing two hydrogens, only one hydrogen is present on this carbon. Write that hydrogen on that carbon. Next to that is C double bond OH. This is called but to in all. One, two, three, four carbons. But second position double bond is there in and aldehyde group is there all. But to in all. Both are same. See here both the products in a short way we wrote the product let us try to write another product ch3 c double bond o ch3 acetone molecule is undergoing a reaction in the presence of a base with another acetone how to write a product just by seeing the reactant remove this oxygen and remove these two hydrogens then you'll get CH3. The next, write C. To this C, CH3 is linked, right? That CH3 down. After removing one oxygen and two hydrogens, put a double bond. After removing two hydrogens, one hydrogen is left on carbon. Remaining is same. What is the name of this product, students? Just give the numbering to this. Fourth position, methyl group is there so four methyl total five carbon so pent third position unsaturation is there three in and second position 
ketone group is there so 2,1,4-methyl pent 3 in 2,1 is the name of the product. This is called cross aldol condensation. Now I am going to explain you about uh, this is called aldol condensation. Now I am going to explain you about uh, explain you about cross aldol condensation. So many students ask me doubt about this cross aldol condensation. They are feeling so much difficulty to write the product. If you uh, understand this concept, just uh, click on like button and share this video and subscribe my channel. I am going to review uh, reveal the trick now about cross aldol. Cross aldol condensation very very important cross aldol. So many students feel difficulty. For writing this product now I'm going to explain you clearly suppose acetaldehyde is reacting with propanaldehyde we how many products we get generally students expect just two products but here we are going to get four products four products we are going to get how we get Four products if one acetaldehyde re reacts with another acetaldehyde molecule we get one product one propanaldehyde molecule reacts with another propanaldehyde molecule we get one more product if acetaldehyde is reacting with propanaldehyde we get one product if propanaldehyde is reacting with acetaldehyde we get one product how to write the products let us see When acetaldehyde is reacting with another mole of acetaldehyde. How to write the product? Remove this oxygen and remove two hydrogens. Then you get CH3. C. H is left over on this carbon. And put a double bond because oxygen and two H2s are goes as H2O. And one more carbon and one more hydrogen is left over here. Next C double bond O H. This is first product in cross aldol condensation. If two moles of propanaldehyde are reacting with each other. Then how to write the product? See here. What generally students do the mistake is uh, they remove this oxygen and they remove these uh, two hydrogens. But you should not remove these two hydrogens because this is called alpha carbon. The carbon next to the carbonyl group we call it as an alpha carbon. So remove two hydrogens from this alpha carbon. Now write the product CH3 next CH2 CH next double bond write these two hydrogens you removed and this two ox one oxygen you removed so write this c here to this c the ch3 is linked to one side and next to that is c double bond o h this is the product this is second product when two moles of estaldehyde is reacting this is the product two moles of propanaldehyde is reacting this is the product when acetaldehyde is reacting with propanaldehyde C H three C double bond O H plus C H three C H two C double bond O H. Remove this oxygen. Don't remove these two hydrogens. Remove these two hydrogens because this is alpha carbon, which is acidic in nature. Then C H three C H. Write this double bond C. Connect this C H three to this. Next C double bond O H. This is the third product if this propanaldehyde is going to react with this acetaldehyde then what is the product ch3 ch2 c double bond oh plus ch3 c double bond oh remove this oxygen and two hydrogens because this is alpha carbon then we'll get ch3 ch2 next is ch Oxygen is removed, put a double bond, two hydrogens you remove. So carbon, one more hydrogen is left over. Next, C double bond OH. This is the fourth product. 
in this way we will get four products in cross aldol condensation not two products we get four products in cross aldol condensation let us try this example students benzaldehyde reacts with acetophenone what is the product we get click on the pass button take out the paper and pen and try to write the product between these two reactions then see the answer now i am going to reveal the answer but don't see the answer try on your own first i am removing this oxygen and this is alpha carbon i am going to remove two hydrogens from this so ch double bond ch next to that is c double bond o and benzene group this is the product this is a major this is a product we get here if you got the answer you are perfect in both aldol and cross aldol condensation suppose if you didn't get this answer once again see this video thank you so much